click done. Okay, so you can see we have this tank reservoir, the, the red color, and the aquifer, the blue color. Again, I click. You can see we don't have production history. We haven't produced the reservoir. Okay, we still don't have any well right now. Click done. That's why we don't need to do history matching. These items will all be inactive. Okay. And now let's check the production prediction. Prediction setup. Profile from production schedule. Yeah, we can select. Yeah, actually, we will not do the prediction or the forecasting using Embal. The job will be done by Gap. Okay, later on, we will connect this model with Gap software. But yeah, we can select this one. Production profile using well models. Options use fractional flow models, right? Prediction start, start of production and then user define prediction n will be ended at this date yeah just to make it prepare for any simulation or for any forecasting i will set up this production calculation setup like this one okay and then for the production and constraints I have these constraints, for example. So at 2 January 2005, the manifold pressure or the system pressure is 2000 PSIG. Yeah, the system pressure or the manifold pressure or the separator pressure or wellhead pressure, 2000 PSIG. Okay, basically they are different. Separator pressure is not manifold pressure. Manifold pressure is not wellhead pressure, but I think Amble want to simplify that and they will call all the surface pressure as man pressure or manifold pressure, okay? So it's not bottom hole pressure, it's not reservoir pressure, it's surface pressure, okay? And let's say the constraint for gas rate maximum of 250 mm SCF per day or million standard cubic feet per day. And then at this date, at 2011, I will decrease the, the pressure, the system pressure, the surface pressure to extend the life of the reservoir. Okay, so far so good. And done. Okay. Actually, we can we can do the forecasting using this model. Prediction setup. Profile from product schedule, no wells. Okay, in this configuration, we we don't install any well. So the forecasting will only done by the tank reservoir itself. Click done. Okay, and then for the reporting schedule, automatic. And then production constraints. Actually, I need to, to redo that. Or for example, using wall model again. Okay. But yeah, if you use Using well model, you need to connect it with well. So you need to prepare the well first. Okay. Yeah, actually, if we we if we don't want to install any well in this model, we should select this one profile from production schedule. But the production and constraints will change. Because we don't have well, we cannot consider the surface pressure. All right. That's why the only constraint is only date and the average gas pressure or gas rate. Okay, the average gas rate. We can keep it constant for several time, all right, for some time, and it will decline. 
you can do that actually let's do that i want to take the the date for example it will produce at this one january 1st 2008 right 2008 and let's say the gas rate 250 million standard cubic feet per day click done reporting schedule automatic and check the prediction all right 